can this one possibly be better than the last one? It has to be. It has to be, right? It has to be. It can't nearly be as bad as the other one, right? Not bloop worthy. Well, let's find out right after this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos and we do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. So, can we get through this one without the cussing? Earlier this week, we did a review on the Reese's Peanut Butter Cups Zero Sugar, or the miniature peanut butter cup Zero Sugar. And Joe has been in timeout ever since. I, you wanna know specifically what I said? No. no. Now, I, I guess I won't say it. Thank you. Go ahead and watch that video right up here. I'm going to say don't eat that stuff, though. Thank okay, you. can I say that part? Bless your heart. It, it was better the other way, though. I, I, I know. So, at the request of a lot of you guys, subscribers, tonight is our live stream. Rachel walked in the door about 30 minutes ago from hanging out with our daughter all day. But I want to get this done, even though I'm looking up there and seeing the chat going 15 I minutes before the live stream. I did not fight him on this, though, because chocolate, and I feel like this is going to be a better option. So Hopefully. we're going to review the Quest peanut butter cups. All right. Never had these. Immediately, oh. okay, I like this. This isn't a miniature. Now I feel like we're we're in Reese's category here, yeah. right? Yeah, like I remember it. Oh, you're gonna like this even better. Don't look, we're supposed to eat I'm it. Not, I'm just looking at the serving size as the entire container. Two, two cups. Two cups. So that's the serving okay. size. Okay. Are you ready? Now we talking. So since we really haven't had dinner yet, other than a couple of jalapeno poppers. This is a great dinner. Do you wanna just split one now and then yes. maybe save one for our dinner? Yes, please. Because we are in the middle of vlogging anyway. Yum. Oh, our dessert for dinner is Maria Emmerich's protein pudding. The egg, we could put this into the pudding. Okay, now you're talking. That is the scooper. Okay, so immediately, I don't have the camera over there because we're vlogging with it, but I can tell you that looks like a nice peanut butter cup. Nice, big filling. It smells like a nice peanut butter cup. It does. Does it smell like Reese's? No, it does not. No. But it smells like but a chocolate peanut a butter. butter. You ready? Yeah. Oh, we didn't dink it. Oh. Dink. That's very good. That is like really good. Like melt in your mouth. That is very good. It's not like bitter chocolate. Mm -mm. Right? It is it's a milk chocolate. It's almost like a milk chocolate. It tastes very like good, fresh. I like is the fact- Is it as peanut buttery as a Reese's? No. No, but the texture of the middle is better than that garbage Because that we there's ate no the other grit. Day. There's not that, like a bunch it did. of grit. It had like a sand grit to I don't it. even want to know what was making that consistency, but yeah. Yeah, considering they didn't even have any like a erythritol or anything in now, it. Now, I like that they've given me a nice edge. I can eat all the way around because you know I eat weird. Eat the bottom, eat the top, eat the middle. These are good. Really good. You want to do five things? Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're going to talk about the ingredients. Uh, does it keto based on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? A little dinky. I got distracted because you like lost a piece of peanut I, butter and I wanted to grab it and eat it. Well, I was afraid because the cat is right here, of course, because okay. we're sitting on the bench and, and I was afraid she fell, but it was not. It was okay, so you have not, I ran to the store while you were up hanging out with Michelle today. Mm -hmm. I picked these up in Target. So number one, the ingredients. Okay. Whey protein isolate. That's a lot better than maltitol. That being the first ingredient. Number two ingredient is erythritol, which is surprising because Rachel has an aversion to erythritol. And like you there's normally, no cooling. there's no cooling there's effect no at cooling all. Effect. You didn't complain about it and you complained about erythritol without me ever even telling you there's erythritol I, in there. I, 
I usually am like, ugh, as soon as I get it. Like, I want to like something, but that right. cooling effect just, like, wrecks it for me. No cooling effect. And that's one of the things about Maria Emmerich's pudding, yeah. even though we're not talking about that. That does have, if you make it the way she designed it, a half a cup of swerve, which is powdered erythritol, yet there is zero cooling effect it, in I, that. It's magic. And we actually made a recipe. It's going to be in a vlog. I'll leave a link for that up here if it's out when this comes out. But... I actually made it with half and then added a little bit of liquid sweetener. And Still good. It tastes just as good and doesn't affect the texture. So yeah. if you want to cut down total carbs, maybe cut down erythritol. Side note. I'm anyway. about it. Number three ingredient, unsweetened chocolate. Thank you. I like that. Now, they are not telling you what's in the chocolate. They're just saying unsweetened chocolate, but I'm good with You're telling me it's unsweetened. Right. Not negligible amount of sugar. Like, I'll decide for you, Rachel. Then we have cocoa butter, then peanuts, palm kernel oil, soluble corn fiber, sodium castanate, and then contains less than 2% of sunflower lecithin, sea salt, butterfat, natural flavor, peanut oil, and sucralose. So this is not a steak. It is not, it is not but eggs and bacon. But it's clean ingredients. But it's it's a treat. Yep. It's not something we eat every day, but it is a very nice alternative to the, the, the ingredients we read in the last one. The most undesirable ingredient for most people is gonna be the soluble corn fiber. Some people it affects more than others. Yeah. If you take our stance, and that is count the fiber. If you want to do net carbs, at least count the fiber. If you want to take off the sugar alcohol, so long as it's erythritol or allulose, which is not really a sugar alcohol, I'm good with that. Don't take off mal all sugar alcohols like maltitol. Right. But if you want to take off erythritol, have at it. Your body doesn't digest it. We still recommend a total carb cap, though. Yeah. Because this for way your, you don't eat this entire box. For your enjoyment. Are you going to drink coffee or are you going to do number two? I'm going to go do number two. Does it keto based on a nutrition label? So let's take a look. So there's four servings per container. There's two cups in a two serving. Cups. I actually think that that's really nice because yes. these are good size They're cups. Decent. I can see us splitting it and having a half a serving. But even if you don't split it and mm -hmm. you eat it yourself, there's only going to be 190 calories. 15 grams of fat, 11 grams of protein, 13 total carbohydrates, four dietary fiber, and eight erythritol. So they're saying like one they're net They're saying carb. one net carb, but again, I would not Leave deduct the fiber. the fiber just in case your body does digest the fiber. So it's five net, if it's so, five total carbs. So you, five total carbs if you take don't take off the fiber, but even at 13, that is so, I mean, that's like the same carbs you were looking at with the other garbage. Only they were giving you maltitol, telling you it's a sugar alcohol, which it is, but no. maltitol increases glucose. It just does it much Slowly. slower than sugar, but it still increases glucose. Erythritol, does it increase your glucose? Well, and no bathroom pyrotechnics for me. Well, like, you could have some gastric distress from well, too much erythritol. Let me tell you. But not like maltitol. Not like we had after we did that review. Because yeah. it had been a while since we had had Maltitol, like and when we first started. So afterwards, I mean TMI, but it was like it it, it was a rough it was a rough evening. It was a rough evening. Yeah. <laughs> Number three, how do they taste? I think they taste really good. Really good. Really good. And I like the fact that they're bigger. Yes. So me too. I feel like always I'm, bigger. I'm, Go big. Go I home. feel like we're we're back to like an original Reese's instead of a little pint size kind of thing. It was delicious. I really think they're good. Uh, number four, how much do they cost? So I got this box at Target. For five dollars and eighty nine cents. No, ah, because that crap was five dollars. Yeah. This is five dollars and eighty nine cents. Five dollars and eighty nine cents. So you're looking at four four of these Stick double cups. Me. I'm gonna. T I, I don't remember how many ounces were in that bag. I'm gonna tell you this is probably. I I don't know. I don't remember. Yeah, I think that you're close to the same amount. They're yeah. just they're telling you three little cups. I was gonna say so there was eighteen little cups in the minis pack for five dollars. Mm -hmm. That was garbage. That was what six servings then. Five eighty nine for this, and I mean honestly, you could just eat one cup and I think be satisfied. Yeah. like that would be fine. Yeah, and and so like that's pretty awesome. I think that's really eight, eight good. good size cups. Number five, would we recommend it? Heck yeah, absolutely recommend this. If you're looking for a peanut butter cup that you can grab and go. At most stores, they're going to carry it in Walmart. Yep. Our Walmart was actually sold out, which is why I ran to Target. But you can find them in health food stores like GNC. You can find them in Walmart, in Target. A lot of times you're even going to find them in a place like Wawa. This is a grab and go option. Yeah. If you're looking for that peanut butter cup and just like, I really have to have it. And I think it's good. 
I like the fact that there's only four in here, so you're not stockpiling a whole bunch of them. But right? they're good size, so I don't feel like I'm being deprived. So yeah. way to go, Quest. Very proud of you for doing it right. Please don't buy the garbage. No. That we did the review on the other one, the Reese's Zero Sugar garbage yeah buy this yeah and honestly we're noticing the biggest hang up is usually price yep and so there's it's a good price there's not a like a you know grand canyon chasm between the garbage and the good stuff yeah so let's get the good stuff well we have a live stream in just 10 minutes let's do it so let us know down in the comment section have you tried the quest peanut butter cups what did you think about them i actually saw they have a bunch of other snacks now again we're not too much into buying these things but if there is a product like this that you would like us to review, let us know. Go ahead and let us know down in the comment section and we'd be happy to pick it up. Or if you see something that maybe you can't get anywhere, you can always send it to our mailbox. The address is linked down below. Now, if you like seeing videos like this, go ahead and check out some of the other videos that we have linked right over there. Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent video, which I'm gonna put right over here. But whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way. Subscribe to our channel and click the little bell icon, and that way every single time we taste something better, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. bye.